Long before accused killer Emmanuel Lopes was wheeled into Quincy District Court, still wearing a hospital gown, dozens of police officers from Weymouth and beyond arrived to fill the courtroom. A somber show of respect for their fallen brother, Sergeant Michael Chesna, and innocent bystander Vera Adams. The distraught officers and family members held back their emotions as the prosecutor detailed the cold-blooded killing that started with Lopes allegedly throwing a rock at Sergeant Chesna. Chesna immediately fell to the ground and dropped his firearm. The defendant was then observed picking up that firearm and eventually firing several times at Officer Chesna's head and torso. The defendant still had Officer Chesna's firearm and fired three times at Miss Adams. Do you understand those charges, Mr. Lopes? Yes, I do. Lopes was interviewed by a court-appointed psychologist no, right before the arraignment. He indicated um, that he um, disagreed with the charges, but he understood them. He understood that they're serious. The doctor concluded that Lopes was competent to be arraigned, but the defense attorney is already creating doubt about the sanity of his client. I've been unable to speak with him in any coherent fashion regarding anything about the case. He has a long and detailed history of psychiatric disorders. The defense had been asking the judge to send Lopes to Bridgewater State Hospital for a 20 day evaluation. The judge denied that. Instead, Lopes is being held at the Norfolk County Jail as he awaits trial.